Now, normally, I do reactions to music. But every once in a while, somebody on my Patreon or in the Super Chat uh, Super Stream we do once a month where people can request damn near anything, say, hey, let's make him watch a Winnebago video. And I don't know why. It's time for reaction. Hey everybody, my name is Old School Nerd and uh, I have no idea what we're doing. All I know is, is that I did a super stream on this last Sunday. And one Sunday a month, I do a super stream where people can super chat request or they can do requests on the stream and I gotta do them. And one of my big buddies, I guess, on YouTube said, hey, gotta do this one. It's for Wednesday, bro. Because he knows today is What the Hell Wednesday. And he's like, yeah, this is definitely What the Hell Wednesday. And I was like, all right. And I saw the title and I was like, the definitive Winnebago man. And I'm like, but why Winnebago? Now, for those who are wondering, yes, my grandfather had one of these. We went on many vacations in the Winnebago. And um, it, was, it was quite something. In fact, my grandfather was so cool. Okay, let me put it like this. My grandfather was like, 78 years old the first time i went camping with him in the winnebago we went down to burns point louisiana which is a little coastal town uh on the vermilion bay to the gulf of mexico and the front license plate on his winnebago had had an, a picture of an old dude an old man with a hat with a jockey hat and a pipe and it said i'm not a dirty old man i'm a sexy senior citizen that was my granddad holy shit Okay, so my name is Old School Nerd. Check us out on OldSchoolNerd.com. It's got all the social media posts, the Patreon link for those who want to help support the channel and request more shit like this. Now, the person who did request this said, this is for What the Hell Wednesday. And this person doesn't, he's not going to send me crap. There's a reason. I don't know if this thing's going to catch on fire. Uh, he's going to die talking. I don't know. I've never seen this. So this is called The Definitive Winnebago Man. It's seven and a half minutes long. What the hell can you watch for seven and a half minutes about a Winnebago? All right. The Winnebago Concepts and Engineering Departments have developed a multifunctional bathroom. Privacy, I don't even know what the fuck I'm reading. <laughs> I wonder what the fuck the real dialogue is. What the fuck is this thing? All of the windshield, for fuck's sake. Oh, fuck. What? What the fuck did I say? That didn't sound for shit, did it? And here under the hood we've stored something that'll really come in handy if it doesn't fall out and break my leg <laughs> what we're doing is we're building a fucking industrial film trying to give these guys everything they can get to me and that's it fuck it i don't even know what the fuck i'm saying <laughs> what's going suppose we open what's going on this guy sucks at his job and he's really bad and look you can obviously tell that this was filmed probably in the 80s on a vhs camera because of because the resolution is so it's I didn't cut it off. It's actually classic um, square format like you'd see on a TV. But man, this is this guy's really pissy. He drops a lot of f bombs. It's kind of like you know, it's like when he wasn't making this Winnebago commercial, he was writing the script for Scarface. Those who've seen Scarface know what I'm talking about. I wonder if his name is Tony. Got to do it again, right now. Oh, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> fuck. Oh, fuck. Shit. <laughs> Tony, do me a favor, will you please? Will you? Will you, will you? Tony. Oh, my God. What the hell's going on? Do me a kindness. Leave. Yeah. I think I want to be walking in and out if you're going to fuck up and I got to come back. I don't that make any difference to me at this juncture. Thank you very much. I appreciate that, Tony. Don't slam the fucking door. <laughs> no more.
Now listen, I've got to give a, a clue here now. I don't want any more bullshit any time during the day from anyone. That includes me. It's going to be very hot. It's going to be very uncomfortable for everybody. Want anybody yelling. We get anybody yelling around here anymore today, and then the shit is going to hit the fan. And they fit the diverse needs of a very big fern, and they fit the needs of a very diverse Buyer segment. I, why can't I remember? I wrote this stuff. Why can't I remember it? Eh, why don't I say it fucking right? What does the goddamn line say, Tony? What is the goddamn line? I don't give a shit what the line is. I fucked up the word rear. I can't even read the fucking B.O. straight. What the fuck was that? We got flies all over the fucking place. Son of a bitch. Get out of here, you fucking flies. There's a fly over the headlight, Tony. We got flies coming for us. Fuck. Fuck out of here, you flies. We got three flies, five flies. And if you will, make sure, if you will, we don't... Not like the resolution back then, you could see flies on, it, on that shot. But... He's a professional. He's, he's going to get this on the money. Or he's going to have a stroke trying. <laughs> don't have that fly on the left side, on the passenger side, because we don't have that in frame, but make sure we don't have any flies here. And we don't have any flies. Here we go. Get out of here, you goddamn jackass. I gotta read it again because my mind is just a piece of shit this morning. God, I can't fucking make my mind work. Tony, give me a towel for just a minute, please. Poor Tony. That. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I was, I'm blinded by that. Here's the best part. We're not even halfway through. I promise you this guy's going to have a coronary, a stroke, maybe both before this is over. And I'm enjoying the hell out of it. Fucking hot light. God damn son of a bitch. What do you mean why I'm going to fall off the fucking thing? Fuck. Just keep running. Bullshit. I'm going to slate this fucker. All right, I, I haven't got time to mark this motherfucker. Here we go again. We can't hear anybody. Nobody can talk to anybody. Still well, turn the fucking thing off, you dumbass. And I'd like to kick your fucking head in. <laughs> Meet innovation. Money. Not even funny anymore. Son of a bitch! Jesus Christ. Fuck! Holy shit. Son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. Fuck! Shit. Son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. There's no way this guy lived to see the millennium. There's just no way. There's no way this guy could be this wound up, this tight, make it through the 80s and the 90s to get to the millennium. There's just no way. My dad wasn't nearly as wound up as this asshole, and my dad died in 1999. Granted, he was killed by a drunk driver, so tech flies. Fly in here. <laughs> Tony? <laughs> to be a Winnebago commercial salesman. God. Whew. I just don't even know what to say. So I'm not. Go ahead, keep going, dude. Oh, fuck. Shit. Son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. Fuck off! What the hell's the line? Shit! What the fuck is it? Can't remember the goddamn line. The accoutrement that you will need. Accoutrement? What is that shit? <laughs> I don't know, shit. It's just all gone. I get so goddamn diuretic when I sit here, and my mouth just never stops. For 1989, each individual storage compartment has this controlled light that you can put up your fern if you want to. How's that? What shot is it? Oh, shit. What did I do? Did I walk? Did I walk through it? It's going to be very helpful in keeping you from falling down, you big dumb son of a bitch. You're <laughs> disturbing my, what's left of my brain. Yeah, but my mind is such shit. I to say nothing of the flies in my head. Oh, Got a no fly more. in my mouth and every fucking other thing happens. If I knew what the rest of the line was, then I would be in good shape. <laughs> Amazing how I just okay. dabble. Uh, 
Uh-oh. I guess my mind is going again. My body is dismembered from my mind completely. <laughs> <laughs> Which is pretty average with me, but I can't think. Something is wrong with me. Why'd you think I was making this up as I was going along? <laughs> my mind isn't working enough to do this any better than it is. I was going bananas. My mind is just going to go completely. My own mind is deteriorating. Because I don't think I can get out of this thing worth a shit. Nobody can, so you know. Apparently, he's so good at pronunciating pronunciation of English words, he could be my grandfather for all I know. Because I'm bad at this shit, too. Luckily for me, I do everything in one take, whether I make a mistake or not. This guy is so wound up to be perfect, that's half his problem. He should just wing it. Dude, if you make a mistake, it's no big deal. However, I do believe that possibly the video of this guy, the way he looks and everything with the ball head and everything, this could be the entire, this video might have fallen into some producer's inbox in Hollywood and said, that's red from that 70s show. Doesn't he? I mean, yeah. Doesn't he seem like red from that 70s show? Really does, man. Turn up a bobber schnabber rubber. Bird a chud a bachi. Compatch a chunchu bachi wachi. Catch a shit and bark. What the fuck is it? Did the weed change your body? He don't work it out. Ranji Chadaba. The Sata Pachakaya. French gun chacharata. Pasha. What's he pay a puck a ship out with you? So when does he start selling Winnebago's to Pentecostals? Because he's speaking in tongues. Sorry. Waka yaka. What's he puck a. Boy, that was good. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. That was shot at Schmickish Bosch. Baji Baji Ba. Baji Baji Ba. The Harvey Baji Ba. Baji Kenji Baji. Little Pucker Chen with a guy, a punch young Rachi. Watch ha. Watch. Chicken Choyak. The Super Storage Sun Cruiser offers maximum storage to a very diverse group of the ferns and the docks. The automotive fuses, ferns they're all the laying docks. out here in beautiful condition for the fern and the dock. Let's go. And particularly at night, whenever you find your fern in your dock, I don't know. And they're made with an insulating material which really preserves the fern and the dock and the whatever, and I don't know. Shit. The Sunflyer now enjoys a full five inches in increased diameter on the fern. And the Pearl Watch. Oh, shit. Son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. Among the questions that you may be asked is, can I get this rig in and out of my driveway? No. Well, the answer is yes. The departure angle for the all-new 1989 Chieftain is exactly that of the 88 model. Ain't worth Whoa! It. Not this shit. It ain't fucking worth it. The Mini Winnie. Part of American tradition. And today on the cutting edge of design and function in a Class C motor home. Let us get the fuck out of here. <laughs> you believe any of that shit? <laughs> okay, so those, okay, so it w immediately went to, um, it immediately went to the Transformers one I just did. Okay, so, holy crap. The Winnebago Man. Yeah, that dude's wound up so tight. You could stick a lump of coal up his butt, and in about two weeks, you'd have a diamond. By the way, yes, I stole that line from Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Also something that was probably made around the time this video was made, and also around the same time that Transformers... The movie, what the hell is it, 1986 Day? We went from What the Hell Wednesday to 1986 Day. So I'm 12 years old. Uh, I still have this from when I was 12 years old. And um, the Winnebago man has got to be dead by now. God help him if he's still alive because he would be bitter eating jello in an old folks home. My God. Um, and yes, if you did see the Transformers um, cover song by um, Cybertronic Spree, um, it was pretty cool. So check that out if you missed it. It's the video right before this one. My name is Old School Nerd. And yes, I'm old. I'm old enough to remember what it was like to ride and camp in camping in one of these. Again, my grandfather was um, not, not as angry as this guy. Oh.